Alright, welcome back. I see your name is Kimbrace, and yes, we are still on Sarkod Yes video. I'm talking about 1 million CDs, of which he didn't invite Inboy, an underground artist that he featured on the same words record. You know, Bob, you know, um, I came here in my previous video, I let you know that people were disappointed, and they are still disappointed in Sarkod Yes for no words, um, inviting a guy for the video shoot. And I told you that I was going to be back again if there was an update. And yes, there is an update. This is the reason why Sarkwadi didn't invite Inboy. So this is from At Atacabs. Sarkwadi Milon CDs. While we was out in Mikunos, at JKJS thought we should shoot a quick visualizer whilst we were waiting for people to arrive for the main video shoot. Took a walk, found a spot and shot this little video featuring at Prisla Anyambu underscore with the moves. Alright, so that's it. This is a tweet coming from the director who actually shot the video for Sarkodie. And honestly, we've understood that this is the reason why Sarkodie didn't invite Inboy. We get it. But we are still on what we said and what we are still saying. Sarkodie didn't try. In no force at all, for real. We for be honest. We for be really was honest. I'll be fan of Sarkodie, but with this one, you no try. We get them say you guys were actually in Greece and you, you, you found out that the location was um, the right place for that video shoot. But at least, at least you guys were supposed to inform the guy. Yes, he is an underground artist, but you, you, you found out that he was good for the project. That's why you included him. So why not the video? Why not the video? This sounds like an entitlement, but at least the writing must be done. You can't tell me that um, you, you, you can actually feature Black Sheriff, um, Kim Promise, Kwame Jin, Kidi, um, Shatawale, and when it's time for the video shoot, you just shoot the video without us letting them know. You, you can't tell me that it wouldn't even happen. Or is it because he's what, an underground artist? Is that how we treat an underground artist? Come on. This is not cool. So how could they not try? If I'll be honest. He not try at all. At least. He, the guy even said that he, he didn't even know about the video shoot. He didn't know anything. In, in nothing come on even um sakura's personal director i'm talking about director oj has something to say all right so this is from director oj i understand how ink feels but this is definitely true it's never planned and we shoot sometimes it comes out sometimes it doesn't drip 101 was reshot because we thought we could quickly shoot a scene while waiting to shoot stir it up once money is spent might as well release all right, so I'm this from director OJ. This is what he's saying. And if you are to understand what he's saying, all that he's trying to say is that they never thought of doing it. Like it was on plan. You Bob, they felt like let's do this and pop, they did it. And even though they never contacted Ink Boy, but because money was spent on that project, they had to release it. You did Bob. But it's 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 not fine. It's not fine. But well, at least um ink boy has what um the exposure now because being on sakura's album is is everything even though he was not in on, in a video but charlie people ask you know he has even released what a new record dressed to kill um i want you all to go stream it on all music world's platform let's do this all right so that's it but you know we are still waiting for sakura's reaction we are still waiting whether he's going to react to this particular issue circulating over the internet about him or not we know definitely he will not do it but let's see whether he will do it but if he, if he does it too i'm gonna be here and let you know my name is kim prince i sign out subscribe to the channel and stay updated bye bye